Another way to create a filter across different data sources is to create a separate view and use that view as filter on the dashboard. So let's, uh, let's create a worksheet first. And suppose we're using the site ID as the global filter. Uh, let's place it on the worksheet first. Uh, and then site ID on the text. And then let's do hide the header. So we only want to see the values. One thing to make sure is uh, if these two charts, these two data collections uh, are the ones you want to filter on, make sure the site ID has the same values. Okay, and uh, so this is from one of the connections. Let's go to the dashboard. So right now I have the two charts on the dashboard, uh, but I need the view here. Okay, let's do change the name. Select a site. And make them the same. The same as the other filters. We also want to do fit width. Okay, and you can also do. Um, uh, you can also format on the worksheet to make sure uh, you have the same color, same. Uh, border, but just uh, pretend this is done, and then click on not the title. S click on this, and choose use as filter. And now this is a filter. Now, if we do Austin. and AJC, and the two charts changes. And that, and the one good thing about this method is you can uh, press control and then select multiple values. So this is how you can use uh, a view to filter across different data sources.